Hi, Joe here. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can use the design editor in Acquire 3.0. So from the dashboard and planner, we're going to hit create to create our post. And you'll see this little icon called explore plugins. And here you'll see the design templates that you can choose from. I'm going to select Instagram post. And you'll see on the left hand side loads of different templates that you can choose from in different categories. You can also search for them. So, for example, let's do necklace. And you can see all templates related to necklaces, jewelry. I like this one, so I'm going to select that. Of course, you can edit the text within and change the font, the size bold underline, um, you can animate it, add effects. I'd recommend you play around with those settings. We also have photos on the left hand side. So um, you, know, you could search for necklace again and you could pick one of these images onto here, as you can see. We also have videos. So if you wanted to produce a video, can choose which ones you want for your image and add it there. Let's delete that for now. We also have music, so if you are creating a video, I'd recommend you explore all the different types of um, music that we have to offer. Animations, so also for videos, as you can see, animations. Objects, so we can add an object to this image. Um, so let's just scroll down. Maybe this one's cool. Shrink it. Maybe rotate it a bit. Add that to the image. We also have background, so you can play around with the background of the image. Text to add different textiles. Lots of different texts to choose from. You can just play around and, and, and add that. We also have brand kits where you can uh, upload your logo. You can choose your color palette. You can choose your fonts. And you can, can create multiple brand kits for maybe different clients that you have with different brands. And finally, you can upload your own images um, and also videos. So I've uploaded this one earlier and we'll just click on it. And the final thing I wanted to show you in the editor is this remove background option. So as you can see, it's a white background. If you just hit remove background, as you can see there, the necklace, um, the background has been removed and um, now you can put the necklace on your image. So that's just a, a few things you can do with our editor. I'd recommend you play around with it, um, but those are the most popular options you can uh, use in the editor. And I hope you found this video useful. Thank you.